So at the moment, what we've seen is running everything we've needed through the IDE. That's fine as we're developing stuff. What we're eventually going to want to do is stick this into continue integration. So we have to learn how to use Maven from the command line, because that's essentially all we're going to do in a continuous integration environment. The same commands that we'd use to run from the command line, we just put in our continuous integration tool like Hudson or Jenkins or whichever one we use and run the Maven commands from there. So let us figure out how to run these tests from the command line. So I'm going to look for the project now. At the moment, I know that I currently have two projects. I've got the Eclipse one in the workspace folder and the IntelliJ one in the IDEA projects. Both of these are pretty much the same, so it doesn't matter which one we pick, they've both got a POM. Since we're here, I'm going to do this. Now from Explorer, I'm pretty sure we know that in Windows 7, when I do a right click with Shift, I get an open command window here. If I just do right click, open in a new window, normal Explorer stuff, but I can open a command window here. So now I'm in this folder, I can see a POM file. So all I have to do is maven clean test. And what that will do is tidy everything up, clean everything out the target folder for me, compile the source code, stick it in the target directory, and then run the tests. Anything that has got test on it in the, the test path will run as a test. And there we go. That's it. It's done. I've used Maven to run the tests from the command line using Maven clean test. Now remember, if you run through the, the Maven instructions, you'll see what other commands there are. That's pretty much all it takes to do it from the command line.